Yo, what is up, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'll be sharing with you guys five free cybersecurity trainings that are beginner friendly that you can take today. Now, if you're someone who's just beginning their cybersecurity journey, right now is a pretty hard time because a lot of the entry level certifications on the market right now are hundreds of dollars and they're pretty expensive, especially for someone who's just looking to get started in their learning journey. If you guys are new to the channel, my name is Ben and I work in cybersecurity and make videos like this to help you also break into the industry. So if you don't want to miss any more videos like this one go ahead and subscribe and join the family with that said let's go ahead and get right into the video so number one on the list is going to be ibm skill build Cybersecurity training they offer several free courses that go over different technical skills including cybersecurity. so the ibm skills build Cybersecurity course will teach you multiple core concepts when it comes to cybersecurity. so the four courses that make up this training is first of all introduction to Cybersecurity. it goes over the ci a triad addressing some misconceptions about cybersecurity and the importance of cybersecurity laws and ethical considerations. Course number two is cybersecurity on the offense. So this is going to teach you all the basics when it comes to offensive security within cybersecurity. So this includes walking you through different types of attacks, social engineering techniques, mapping out attacks using the MITRE framework, and also getting hands-on with different network scanning tools. The next course is cybersecurity on the defense side, which is pretty much the blue team side of things. So pretty much the foundational principles of being a security operations center analyst. So it'll walk you through how to prevent and detect cyber attacks and also basic cryptography and incident response tactics. And the last course is called Your Future in Cybersecurity and it pretty much walks through the entire cybersecurity job market and also what kind of key responsibilities and tasks you'll probably face if you become a cybersecurity analyst. There's also an assessment at the end of this course which you need 80% to pass and also also, upon completion of this training, you'll also earn a Credly badge, which you can post on your resume and also your LinkedIn. If you guys want to check out any of these trainings that I mentioned in this video, I'll leave a link to all of them in the description below. So at number two on the list, we have AWS.training and SkillBuilder.AWS. And these two platforms are going to be the free learning platforms offered by AWS. So just as you'd expect, these learning platforms will give you guys free learning resources, courses, and trainings that you can use to study for different cloud computers computing concepts. They also offer different learning paths that you can use to study for different types of roles. So for example, you could learn cloud architecture, AI, cloud security, and DevOps. They also offer different courses that go over different AWS services. And I personally use AWS.training becoming a cloud practitioner. I did the entire series and use that to pass my AWS cloud practitioner exam. These courses are completely free. Some of them are completely online. Some of them also offer different virtual and classroom environments. Environments. It's a great resource with high quality education and it's taught by AWS professionals. So I highly recommend you guys check it out and use it to study for your next AWS exam or just brush up on different services and learning paths and learn how to use AWS as a whole. Number three on the list is going to be Splunk's course catalog. If you guys aren't familiar with Splunk, it's pretty much a log management and analytics tool that's also used as a SIM, so a security information and event management tool. Splunk is a tool that's highly used throughout the entire industry, especially for someone who is on the blue side of things. So think about a security operations center analyst. They're going to be using Splunk pretty often throughout their entire workday. So getting familiar with how to use Splunk and how to use different SIMs. So for example, learning how to query, how to filter different logs, and also how to build dashboards and reports, and also learn how to automate different tasks within the SIM. These are going to be some vital skills to have going into your first role in cybersecurity. And the free course catalog offered by Splunk has so many different courses that go over different sort of skills needed in order to navigate using a sim. So for example, there's some courses that go over how to create a report and dashboard. There's a course about how to query a sim and filter logs. And also there's a course about how to conduct an investigation and there's so much more. So moving on to number four on the list, and this is going to be the introduction to cybersecurity offered by the Cisco Networking Academy. So this is a free course offered by the Cisco Networking Academy, and it's going to give you a basic overview of cybersecurity as a career. It's also going to walk you through different types of attacks and techniques that you might stumble upon as a cybersecurity analyst. There's also a final exam at the end of the training in order to pass. So I would highly recommend this course specifically for people who are brand new to cybersecurity. And if you want to see if cybersecurity is something interesting to you, I wouldn't say it's a course for people who are looking to get technical skills and get hands on experience. It's more of a theoretical course that walks you through the basics of cybersecurity. Number five on the list is going to be the Microsoft course catalog. 
This is going to be pretty similar to the AWS course catalog where they offer multiple different free courses that go over different services, learning paths, and different skills needed in order to operate in the Microsoft cloud computing environment. So these courses offered by Microsoft are going to be focused on using Azure, which is their cloud computing platform, and which is also extremely popular throughout cybersecurity and these organizations. So they offer multiple different courses so you can learn the basics of cloud computing, AI and machine learning, and different Azure services and Microsoft products. Cloud computing is a huge chunk of cybersecurity, so being able to get these basics of AWS and Azure are going to be extremely handy when you first go into your role in cybersecurity. And last but not least, I also have a bonus course for you, and this is going to be Course Careers IT course. A lot of times beginners find it difficult to break straight into cybersecurity, and a lot of times people start with IT and then from there get years of experience and then move on to cybersecurity. This is probably one of the most common pathways that people take into cybersecurity. And Course Careers offers an IT course that walks you through the basics of IT and also how you can land your first job in IT. It's a completely beginner friendly course. You don't need to have any prior experience in IT or cybersecurity to get started. They also have so many success stories of people landing their first jobs in IT. So if you guys want to check it out, I'll leave a link to all these courses in the description below. So with that being said, those are going to be the free training courses that I have for you in this video. If you found this video helpful and insightful, go ahead and drop me a like and subscribe to the channel if you are new. It really helps me out. And also, if you want some more short form content and lifestyle content, be sure to follow me on Instagram and TikTok at Cyber with Ben. And overall, just to wrap it all up, the barrier of entry for cybersecurity jobs has been increasing as employers are demanding more years of experience and also higher level advanced certifications. And these certifications can be really expensive and difficult for someone who is looking to break into cybersecurity. So these free courses and trainings are going to be a perfect way for you as a beginner to get started learning and not having to pay so much up front. And as you begin to complete these trainings and developing your skills, you can move on to more advanced level certifications. And then from there, it's pretty much a snowball effect to eventually land your first job in cybersecurity. I really hope you guys found this video helpful and find these training resources helpful as well. I wish you guys the best and hope you guys continue to enjoy learning cybersecurity. And with that said, guys, thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.